Well, today's the day I've been waiting for for a very long time. So before Christmas, Jen bought me a new shotgun. I think I mentioned that in another video. However, it's been so cold here in Ontario that I haven't been able to get out and shoot it. Today's no difference. It's minus 8. Uh, it's been minus 10, minus 12, minus 17, minus 8. This is as warm as it's been. So I'm going to get out. And take this little fella out probably going to be quick. I can imagine setting up the camera, firing five or six shots, getting back in the truck and getting out, but I'll do my best to show you. Let's head out. Right, guys <laughs> pardon the wind I put this video off for a few weeks now because it's been cold got the new Maverick 88 made by Mossberg I got it for Christmas just about a week before Christmas so haven't shot it yet so I've got uh, slugs double up buck some number fours and number sevens we're just gonna shoot the target see what the pattern looks like I'm gonna be at five yards I'm gonna make it as quick because I'm freezing I'm not going to go into a whole lot of explanation about this out here. I am freezing. Major difference between the 88, the 500, and the 590 is the safety. The safety is down here by the trigger as opposed to a tank safety. We need to get this going. First shot is just going to be a number seven. Very little recoil, very little. It's so cold that the pads I made to hold the shells that go on the side of the gun are not sticky. Next we're going to throw a double up buck. Still not a lot of kick for a light gun. I'm going to try a slug. Again, a slug, still not a lot of kick for a light gun. All right, we got a number four and a number seven. A bigger kick out of the number seven. I like it. get back in the truck I'll talk to you a little more I got to get out of the cold all right guys I'm back in the truck oh my god that's the reason I've been putting this video off I, I got the gun I said about three weeks ago just before Christmas Jen bought it for me for Christmas uh, I wanted a short shotgun I wanted a Mossberg so that's what we got uh, damn it's cold I've only been I was only outside less than 10 minutes my hands are froze but I wanted to get it shot. Now, I learned something here. Um, the uh, cards that I made, it was so cold the tape came off the card. So when the first shot I made, the card hung off the side. The, the tape left the back of the card. It wasn't because the Velcro failed, the tape failed. So better I learn that now than should I find myself in a situation where my ammo is going to fall off the gun. Oh my god, it's cold. 
anyway that's what I wanted to do I want to come and get some shots off just to try it out uh, again I had a slug double up buck some number fours and some number sevens Wow there's a reason I waited and I probably should have waited a little longer anyway I'll talk a little bit more about the gun when I get back home my god it's cold I left my truck running the whole time I was out there because it's that cold anyway let's get out of here Oh my god, was that cold. I told you it was cold. Anyway, we're back home. I love this thing. Love this thing. Let's have a look. So you can see the pattern from the bird shot. The number fours and number sevens. It's kind of all over this here, which is not a bad thing, but it is a short 18 inch barrel. You see the uh, double up buck there. We got a few it's a nine pellet so I believe they're 30 caliber so we got probably what do we got one two three four five six so I'm aiming a little high but I got six on the target which is not too bad if I go down to center mass it was so cold I was just pointing and shooting I was not aiming at anything right there in the forehead we got this sorry about that right there in the forehead we got the slug this over here is the wad this over here is the wad from the double lot, so these two don't count. Slug, double lot, and the rest is birdshot. I like the gun. I really, really like the gun. Depending on where you live, it's good for home defense. It's good for just going out and shooting. It's nice and short. Uh, the recoil was not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Even on the slug, it wasn't that bad. I will say, I did put a high brass number four in it. Uh, that kicked more than the slug did, which was, Jesus, that kicked more than the slug did, which I thought was a little odd, but uh, it's a rifle sling. This is not going to stay. I got to get a shotgun sling for it, but like I mentioned before, the main difference between the Maverick 88 and the 500 and the 590 is the safety. So we have a cross bolt safety down the bottom here. The 500 and the 590 got the tank safety. So if you wanted to go pistol grip, this is the one you put the pistol grip on because it's easier to reach the crossbow safety. A little more difficult, a little more movement if you need to work the safety on the tank. Uh, the other major difference is, is the slide is a complete unit and it's held together with just a pin. If you want to change that out, you got to change the whole thing. Uh, a lot of the parts are interchangeable. The heat shields, uh, you can get uh, different brackets. That will screw on the end here that you can put a light on if you want to put a light on. Uh, it is not tapped on the top. The 500 590s are tapped on the top so that you can put a like a rifle so that you can put an optic on top or a rifle sight. And it just comes with a standard gold or brass bead sight on the end. Very nice gun. Uh, here in Canada, this gun with taxes I think was $370. I know a lot of my friends down south in the states they can get these guns for around 200 bucks. It's Canada. We pay more for everything here in Canada. But as far as I'm concerned, this is well worth it. Nice small gun. So this is a 4 plus 1. However, here in Canada, we have plugs in these things. So it's a 2 plus 1. Plugs are removable. But check your local area to make sure it is safe to do so or lawful to do so. For 379 bucks, this is absolutely worth it. I love this little gun. It shoots like a dream. The slide is nice and smooth. That universal sound. Anyway, that's all I got for today's video. I gotta go get warmed up. I am froze. So before you go, hit that subscribe button, the like button, the share button, because YouTube does not like these videos and I need all the help I can get. So I thank you all very much. I appreciate you all very much and uh, hit the buttons. Don't forget to enjoy the outdoors. Later.